Let me start by saying that the rumors are true. I am a homophobe. I do not support gay rights, and I do not support gay marriage. Hey, hey, everybody, calm down. Not everyone is going to agree with what you believe. Not everyone is going to support everything that you support. We are all entitled to our own opinion, except mine is not an opinion. Mine is a divine fact, backed by a divine book. Gay people never had rights to marry, they never had the right to anything until this century. What the Bible says is that a man shall not and should not lay with another man, and a woman shall not and should not lay with another woman, unless they do what is detestable unto the Lord. Alright? Now let's get that straight. I am not going to support gay marriage, I never have, and I never will. If you want to hate me for that, then go on ahead. Don't vote for me. This thing, this thing right here, Bruce Truesdale, he doesn't care about gay rights. He doesn't care about their cause. He doesn't care about any of you. He's saying what your itching ears want to hear. He didn't care about it until then. He only cares about it now because he's not attacking me. He's taking it as an opportunity to win this election. I care about your people. I care about your soul. I care about your well-being. What does he care about? Nothing but the seat of power. And if you're going to vote for him just because of that, just because he's saying what you want to hear, then so be it. This will not be a country that I want to be the leader of if that's the case. Because, you know, I really miss you. I know, Jocelyn. I, I miss you, too. And I don't know when I'll be back. If I lose the election, it could be late November or early December. And if I win, it could be sometime after January. And by then, we'll have already moved into the White House. How's our boy been doing? He's asleep right now. We had to get his shots today, so he's pretty tired. How are you doing? I've been lonely, but your grandma has been keeping Ben and I company, so that's really helped. We all just really miss you. I can't wait to see you either. This last year and a half has been so hard on the both of us. So, I saw your debate earlier. Huh. That was an embarrassment and a half. My husband, the homo hater, spread all across national news. Look, sweetie. I know you follow the Bible, but. I mean, don't you think you could lighten up a little bit? Not be so harsh on everyone? You don't run a country by being easygoing. You have to be direct and straight to the point. Otherwise, they will eat you alive. I'm afraid of them and nobody else. Exactly. Just be straight to the point. You don't have to be harsh about it. You're right. I'm, I'm sorry for going off on you. I, I guess I've just been taking all these mixed emotions I've been having, you know, 
not being able to see you, not being able to see my family, not being able to see my grandma. I've just been, you know... Listen, sweetie. I love you, okay? Ben loves you. You know, everybody back home, we all love you. And, you know, we all want you to win. But you can't win whenever you're being rude and freaking out every time somebody brings up a point that you don't like. I love you. Love you too. And so does Ben. But I need to get some sleep and you need to get some sleep. So think about what I said, okay? Night. Who are you? Don't come any closer. Stop! Who are you? Hell. Now, who caused all of this? We know that you know. I already told you. I told you everything I fucking know. What were you doing? Well, I was. I was running for president to make this country better. And you guys fucked it all up. You're lying. Let me the fuck out of here. Silence. Warning things. Not you. You're just a pawn in our plan. You know, if I get out of here, I'm gonna fuck the both of you royally up. And your stupid fucking boss, too. Tell us now, who scores this? Why do you keep asking that? You already know who he is. He's the guy you're working for. You're lying. Why did he cause this? I hope you realize you're not getting out of here alive. Cause if that's what you're thinking, you're dead wrong. What is he planning to do? We don't have to tell you any I don't know. I already live with somebody. I don't have a gun.
there. I'm gonna get my partner. He's, just, he's gonna decide if you're gonna stay. Omega! Omega! Come on out! Found a new survivor! Oh. <laughs>